Motherfucker, I'm awesome. No, you're not, dude. Don't lie. I'm awesome. I'm driving around in my mom's ride. I'm awesome. A quarter of my life gone by, and I met all my friends online. Motherfucker, I'm awesome. But I use coconut shampoo in your hair. Wait, what? <laughs> I use it in your hair. Mm. I need an adult. <laughs> I am a motherfucking adult. Mommy? <laughs> I am your mommy. Wait, what? So then you fuck yourself. Yeah! <laughs> right, um, if you'll remember that guy earlier was like, hey, you can't come here, I'm thirsty, motherfucker. Yeah, the same thing applies here. So we have to go through underground path again, which running in straight lines have never been so tedious. <laughs> I wonder something. You know how, uh, uh, you know how they make um, drunk people walk in a straight line to yeah. prove they're not drunk? Yeah. I wonder if they if the same rule applied to games. Like, what happens if you just tell a drunk guy to walk in a completely straight line in a game? Do you think he could do it? Uh, well, he probably could, you know, because fun, you can only go four directions, you can't really go zigzag. <laughs> They'd find a way. Also, if you notice, like, there's this Team Rocket... What's that you say, officer? I can do it. Do, 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 do. There's this Team Rocket girl who seems to be avoiding us. Get out of Team Rocket's way. That's right, there's rockets in this town. Don't ask why. They just uh -oh. are. Alright. In this town, we'll find the next gym, which we're not going to yet, and this is the... Find what you need, the Celadon department store. I think you can buy on um, fire, water, and thunderstones there, which is used to evolve several Pokemon. And, and leaf stones. Oh yeah, leaf stones. Wait, you can? Yeah. Hmm, I didn't know that. Well, I knew it, but, like, I knew there was leaf stones, but I didn't know you could get one there, and... Why does this place exist? Yeah, I... I was there recently, and also the coin counter can kiss my fucking ass because the no the no the slots are the slowest damn way to get coins ever. Yeah, I usually just buy everything. Right, if you go in here throughout the back, this is a I don't want to call it a secret because fucking everyone knows about this. And if you go up to the roof, which we can't run on the roof, which doesn't make any sense because, you know, it's not like running on rooftops is dangerous or anything. We can talk to this guy. There is nothing that I don't know. Like I wrote on the blackboard, I know about the world of Pokemon and your Game Boy Advance. Get together with your friends and enjoy trading Pokemon. Apparently, since this man knows it's all a game, he must be the god of the universe so Arceus can kick his ass, or can kiss his ass. And in fact, since he's wearing a black belter outfit, I imagine he would beat the shit out of Arceus. So all hail random dude number 670. Nine. Right here, you can get Eevee. Um, no, nah, we're gonna nick not gonna nickname him. <laughs> Shut! Damn it, Fallout! You don't understand. We're a ten-year-old. We have dangerous monsters in our pocket. Nothing's too dangerous for us. Uh, Except the other ten-year-old with dangerous monsters. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, love how I said a bike was an important yeah. item, yet I'm not using it. Right. Eevee can evolve in this game. He can only evolve into three of his evolutions, the three original evolutions, which are Flareon, Jolteon, and Vaporeon. Vaporeon's really defensive and has good... Well, it's... Oh, yeah, right here, there's another Snorlax that we can't make move because he's a lazy fucker. Oh, no, it's not like he's holding up progress for anything or something like that. It's not like... Why can't we catch him while he's asleep? That makes no sense, if you think about it. What the fuck? Did I just get messaged on Facebook? Of all places? Holy shit. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Was, oh dear, you found my secret retreat. Please don't tell anyone I'm here. I'll make it up for you with this. Right here we get HMO2, which contains Fly. Fly is one of the more useful HMs in the game because it allows you to instantly go from place to place. And we're going to teach it to our flying HM slave, which... I conveniently just call it Pidgey. Do we still have Pidgey? We probably don't. Yeah, we do. Yay. And now it knows fly, so it can... Get this. Pidgey can learn fly, and you can use it to transport you, but Scyther can't. Explain that. Scyther's Mantis. That's about all I can think of. But Pidgey is like a foot tall. 
<laughs> do, you, do your rider just kind of hold on to its legs and while it's gasping for air in the sweet embrace of death, hoping you don't plumb it to your demise? <laughs> just hold on the entire time about to break its feet off going, Oh god, please don't fall! This is terrifying! <laughs> oh god. Down there is oh, the... Oh, oh shit. He got a phone call. Hey, another rocket rocket. I did. My apologies. Get lost or we'll punch you. Oh yeah, well I'll unleash the devastating deadly monsters in my pocket and murder you. Yeah. Bitch. And of course still no secret item, so that place is completely useless. Alright, I think we're gonna go ahead and tackle the um Celadon Gym or whatever the hell this place is called. Since we have Prime uh, that knows of Psych. Nah, it's the grass gym. Hey, this gym is great. It's full of women. No, it's full of little girls, you fucking pedophile. Oh. Uh. Hey, the guy isn't here. Wow, that's kind of surprising. Oh, well, that's right, because only females are allowed. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah. There are certain Pokemon in here that you have to fight no matter what, but there's a bunch of that you can skip. And here we find the beauty which is just the English translation for slut. But since Rygan knows how to handle the women, he's just going to... <laughs> Luke, is it kind of fitting that Rygan's going to be our star player in the gym with only women? I... yeah, I'd say that's... Anybody knows how to handle bitches and beauties, it's him. Yeah, Rygan gets all the bitches. I'd be mad jail yo. Rygan, make <laughs> Rygan makes all the women super duper sweaty with his hotness coming right from his mouth. <laughs> it makes you feel any better Fallout. Um, technically you are the master of Rygan right now. You're holding his ball in your hand, so uh, yeah. He only has one ball. <laughs> that poor, poor guy. Pleased to meet you. My hobby is Pokemon training. So apparently is everyone else is in the fucking world. Why can't someone take up something less dangerous like knitting? Pokemon needs sweaters too, damn it. <laughs> and once again, oh, what the fuck? Rygan's just gonna completely... Oh, wow, he didn't one-shot it. That's not that surprising. Yay, Leech Seed. Way to waste your only move against me. It's not like... See, Luke's now... <laughs> I like how you said that it was a good move back when you had to choose to get it, but when now other people use it against you, it's shitty. When... Oh, no, it's a decent enough move. It's just that if this late in the game, it's... Well, not really even this late in the game. It's still good this late, but using that as your only move before I kill you with two hits from Ember, it's just... It's kind of a waste. Also, yeah. Screen here, leader Erica, winning trainers, Baller. Baller's already been here once again, which is kind of funny because you can do his rival battle after the gym, which means his Pokemon are technically much lower level than the gyms. Then again, he has Charmeleon, and that just a fire or flying type in Erica's gym will just completely and utterly destroy her. It's not even funny. Okay, it's a little funny. Right, I'll be right back uh, when I'm ready to challenge her. Got to heal up. All right, we're back, and we're going to challenge Erica for her badge. Hello. Lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh, dear. I must have dozed off. Welcome. My name is Erica. I'm the leader of the Celadon Gym. I'm a student of the art of flower arranging. Yeah, flower arranging my ass. She's a grass gym, and she's wearing... <laughs> She's wearing a kimono. She's absent-minded. She's a stoner. She uses grass-type Pokemon. Come on, they couldn't make it more obvious. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea that you wished to challenge me. <laughs> Very well, but I shall not lose. I have a fucking fire-type and a fighting-type that's over-leveled as shit, and it knows Aerial Ace. You don't stand a goddamn chance. <laughs> Go Rygan! Oh, God. You know, I, they used, I know people say that type advantages aren't always that important, but when you combine that with grinding your ass off, I think it is. Type advantages are important as fuck. Go, Rygan! Aw, oh, Rygan's paralyzed by his manliness. Oh, it knows Giga Drain. That's not very good. That's probably going to hurt Rygan. Holy shit, it got a critical. That's... Wow. 
That's not good. Oh, and Rygan still can't move. <laughs> Some grass type. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, um, I was hoping to just use uh, Rygan this fight because he needed the experience. Serious. That was our last super potion, too. Uh, don't hurt us too much. Oh, acid. <laughs> so not only is she on weed, she's on acid, too. That's that's amazing. <laughs> Great I example. imagine whenever a grass Pokemon gets a critical hit from her, she, like, runs onto the battlefield and kicks your Pokemon straight in the nuts. Okay, right. Rygun's not going to do much again in this fight, and, well, let's hope Tog can do better. He probably can. He's level 33. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Uh, you should totally get the experience share. Oh, wait, you only have ten Pokemon. <laughs> Fuck off, Luke. <laughs> Yay. It's about to use Tangela. Tangela, um... Tangela sucks, yeah. quite frankly and simple. Tangela sucks. It gets a better evolution in the later games, but you can't get it in this game, mainly because, well, it didn't exist yet. But, uh... Yeah. Let's, I'm going for it. Let's see if Rygan could... No, Rygan's gonna die. <laughs> you know, I know this is off topic, but I kind of <gasps> I kind of miss Raichu. Raichu is so cool. Oh my god! What? Rygan tanked it! He didn't die! He tanked it! Holy shit! Whoa! Go, Rygan! <laughs> oh my god, Rygan, you're, you're probably my favorite now. Sorry, Luke. No offense. I did. <laughs> okay. I will win your love back, I'm sure. No, you won't. Uh, I'm sure. Oh. Oh, constrict. That ain't even a thing. Now we're Those just gonna. Moves can kiss my ass. Oh. It's gonna end grain. I th think that increases. Not nah, yet. Yeah, it heals itself, but um, if we can get an ember off, that's it's doesn't even matter. Come on, Rygan. you can do it. I believe in you. I. Be <laughs> wow. The one Pokemon that pulls through when I need it, and it's Rygan. This is why we're friends, Rygan. Luke, why can't you be as good as Rygan? <laughs> Bitch, I kicked Brock's ass back when we were first starting. What are you talking about? Oh, Vile Plume. I thought that said Vulpix. Well, yeah, but shut up. And you know what? When you get to that last gym with all those ground Pokemon, I'm going to rape all the asses. This is true, actually, and Rygan will be next to you. <laughs> Rygan went yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now what, bitch? Now what? <laughs> actually, I might just use the other Pokemon I'm planning on catching. And we use Aerial Ace. Oh, wow, that didn't one-shot it. That's kind of... Oh, you annoying cunt. It used... It used Stun Spore on us, Luke. It's just prolonging the <laughs> at this point. Oh, shit. I'd laugh you know, so. Hey, Fallout, hey, Paul, you know what I had when I got to this gym? What? Level 30, uh, level 38 Charizard. Why? <laughs> I don't know, but it was awesome. <laughs> oh my oh. god, Luke, why? Because I hate plants. I hate everything. Like. For the love of God, that's just... It she didn't have a chance. She didn't have a chance. Also, yeah, we get Giga Drain, which is one of the best grass moves in the game. And, um, yeah, we beat the Stoner Gym. Because if we would have lost, we would have had to have bought her a lifetime of Doritos and Cheetos. And, um... Uh, yeah, I think that'll be all for this session. We got kind of far. We got we added a new and one of our most valuable members to the team. We had an evolution that I didn't think would come this early, and and a new intro. <laughs> yeah, that too, that he helped make. Yeah. Right. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed this session. I know I didn't because I suck. I've been that Fallout Three guy. And I've been Lucas Dutting. It's been great being here. And we'll see you next time on the Magical Mystery Tour of Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. Good fight and good night, good people.